Tonight, the Palm Springs City Council continuing to consider where to make cuts with the city facing a dire projected budget shortfall of $76 million through next June. News Channel 3's Jake and Gracia live tonight at home after covering another special budget meeting. Jake, you're covering this, uh, these at home because they're being held, held teleconference, so that's the best way to do it, right? Absolutely, John, and the council has been very carefully considering where to make these budget cuts. They're continuing the discussion until the end of the week, so no decisions made tonight, but they have said that nothing is off the table. As the city of Palm Springs adjourns its third special council meeting, grappling a projected $76 million deficit, still no decisions made on where to make cuts Tuesday night. We are just beginning with the uh, economic uh, challenges. Uh, uh, before us. They're considering cutting nearly $14 million in personnel costs affecting city services. Paramedics and fire and police in library and animal services, those are all value decisions to provide that higher level service. Palm Springs police and fire chiefs speaking out on what the proposed cuts to their departments would mean. It's going to actually touch all aspects of our police department. Uh, Non-sworn support staff, uh, sworn uh, officers, line level, and sworn supervision. The vacancies is a much, much better option than either closing a fire station or reducing our rapid response medic unit. Two to three firefighters will need to fill those vacancies on a daily basis. And as you know, uh, firefighting is a very dangerous occupation. And in an effort to avoid as many layoffs as possible, proposed cuts in non-personnel services total more than $8 million, including $530,000 from homeless services, $500,000 from tourism, $475,000 from the film festival, and $300,000 from the animal shelter. The city facing an estimated 80% downturn in tourism next month and city council fearing there's no end in sight. I don't see in the next few months conventions coming back to town. I don't see flights coming back to town. Splash House definitely is not coming back to town. It's supposed to be in June. Even if we do open up the economy, I don't think we're going to rebound from the losses that we've had. And City Council tonight adjourned, continuing their discussion of these budget cuts until another special budget meeting Friday at 1 p.m. Stay with News Channel 3 as we bring you the latest on the Palm Springs proposed budget cuts. Reporting live from home tonight, Jake Gracia, News Channel 3. Thank you, Jake.